Right, hello everybody, welcome to um, the round of 32 match between Lesnik's High Elves and Diamond's Necromantic. Joining me in the booth is Muppet Pac-Man and Purple Chest. Hello! Hello, hello. Hello, hello, hello. Well, so here we have uh, Lesnik, the Conqueror of Dionysian, uh, up against uh, the recent uh, winner, I believe, of the NAF Championships that would, took place online. Uh, DM or was that DM Lord? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> there's like four of them, the DMs. I have, don't, don't have a clue anymore. Oh, there's, there's a cast. Yeah, I really don't know. And uh, his very effective looking necromantic team. It's not special, but it can get the job done. You know, it's got two decent golems, one with Mighty Bow, both block guard. Two uh, stand firm guard whites, not racy, but very, very uh, effective at blocking space and controlling the space. A mighty blow piling on jump up wolf. Yeah. That's pretty good, isn't it? And Tackle. another wolf. Well, I mean, it's, it's, it's a killer, isn't it? Already uh, pommed one piece out. Yeah. Perfect killer. And the ball carrier there is a strength four with uh, blodge step. And God. Yeah. I think it's sad. I just don't know what else you take. Like, on a double. Oh, I don't. I just can't think of anything. Like, at least he's still useful on a uh, defense. Yeah, and he's yeah, good if he gets Only based. by putting him in places where he can get hit, which is perhaps not ideal. But yeah. uh, then he rolled strength four straight afterwards. So, you know, he's a really interesting piece. Yeah. And yeah, the strength four definitely made it better. It's harder to get hit now. Reasonably early fail there from the elves, and they take it, up it into a removal. The uh, one might well first. KO already. Might well first flesh golem is interesting, but I'm guessing one died and he had to like keep up with the team, maybe. Yeah, maybe. Uh... I don't know. The rate they skill that could have been there since the very beginning. Yeah. Mm. The other one's built a lot slower. Obviously, they just block into guard. So perhaps he felt. Um, I mean, or perhaps you're right, perhaps it, it's skilled late and it's accelerated since. Mm. Uh, we had, we, we did Sea Bros versus World Star Live and it's on the YouTube talk. But there's no, no fat here, is there? It's all very um, lean and effective. Yeah, it's, it's a <laughs> Maybe there's a few zombies that could be uh, fired and rehired. And that wolf it looks like it's going to live on the floor. Shit. Yeah. Never gonna get hit. Uh, I don't see the high elves fouling much, so we can just power on and not get hit. I mean, I think their their sort of foul fodder has already been removed, hasn't it? Yeah, the pretty, much. pretty much. The injury, I think that was the ones that aren't decent elves. I don't see what's left you could possibly foul with. No, this just this uh, trapped one in between the flesh golem. Yeah, yeah, the trapped one. Yeah. Oh, that's a nice, that's a nice uh, rando removal. Yeah, that's a decent sort of strike back from the elves there. And that's the middle of the pitch where, um, you know, if we can stop them going forward now, they can't really go left because they have no one there. Yeah. And he's really using this jump forward to work well without uh, assists. Yeah, it's so nice having that. It really is. It's the ultimate elf accessory. <laughs> Cheeky one dice. Oh, you couldn't dodge away from diving tackle. No, it's a very interesting wolf, the other one, isn't it? Blood step diving tackle. Yeah. I was thinking maybe sidestep, but I guess you go sidestep next. It's just a normal. Yeah, I think so. Um, it certainly feels But I mean, if you've, you've got the double, didn't want another mighty blow. Already had his kill piece. Hit him. Which is, yeah, piling on again, look. I would, have, I would have liked hitting this fella. Don't know about you, but uh... yeah. Um, I, can't, I can't remember where he was. Was he, he like nine nine five? The wolf was like here. He could have just. He could have. Could he get the two assists to stop the frenzy trap? Yeah. Yeah. Obviously, we're fouling. We have two DP zombies. And uh, I think chance. it's because he wanted to do that hit and that foul. Yes. Yeah. I think so too. Yeah. And uh, mm, very effective now there. That's the second uh, one gone. And that's the apple. apple oh, there's used. the apple. Yeah. Well, it was a good piece that got chipped there. Yeah. Was, was there any inducements? I forgot. No, there doesn't seem to be any. Oh, they have exactly the same TV, I remember now. Mm -hmm. and, uh... Interesting fight. 
Yeah, and Diomed won the toss and chose to receive. I forgot to mention that. Hmm. But never mind. <laughs> ha! -ha! <laughs> yeah, it's the high L sounds. When you activate them, they go, ha! -ha! <laughs> Which is pretty great. <laughs> Next, and my new favourite team in Liverpool 2. Diamond tackle. No, we don't need it. We just fail. We just won. Yeah, we all don't want anyway. Yeah. He's got tackle as well, I think, so no dodge there. Well, probably better to be there than uh, taking the head. So, Jim, who are we bombing next? Because we're always bombing. Well, yeah, it's interesting, isn't it? Because you could you could have a shot at this guy with a block, and if you power him, bomb somebody else. But maybe you just go straight into the pond because you got the guard there. Yeah. No, I would suggest if he's moving that guard, it does look like he's trying to. Well, no, he's just bombing him. Just and then you've got sure the DP as well. Yeah, yeah. Wherever, he, wherever he pushed to, there wasn't frenzy trapping. Hey, it's probably the most annoying elf if he gets him on the ball. Yeah. And we foul well, it, they're, they're all annoying, Muppet. I think that's yeah. the, the real secret, isn't it? So a bit, little bit loose, because I thought he was going to foul, but he doesn't foul. He refrains. You know, he manages to keep his composure. He doesn't get a cheeky foul in there, which would have... Uh, you know, I bet he was tempted to foul. Uh, I'm sure you play for all of like two minutes to think of that foul. Yeah. Yeah, yeah this um, this very fast and loose style with the open cage, you, you've got to think it's exploitable, but... Oh, look! Yep, he's going for it. Well, sadly, we don't have tackle. We rolled for strength instead of tackle. What a shame. <laughs> well, we don't have strip ball either, so... Although that's a sure hands piece. But we're coming back in, we need to hit this. Yes, we this is We do have rest, though, so it was a 5 plus effectively. Yeah. This is getting uh, bombed, isn't it, now? Massively. Yeah, he's seen the danger of this guy and he's like, get him off the pit. Ooh! Re uh, instant instant reroll, of course. Instant power. Yeah, yeah absolutely. If you didn't spot that coming, where have you been? <laughs> Oh, if that dodge failed, we could have been. Yeah, there would have been there would have been things around the ball, wouldn't there? But you know, when you said that this team was better than my team, uh, maybe Muppet. What you missed, I think, was there is no guard at all on Lesnick's team. Yeah, and that is very much built to Elf, and the Elf thing ain't working right now. It's very busy. Uh, instead of rolling doubles, rolling steps. Yeah, yeah, that's a thing. He has got lots of nice stats, but without guard, like, how does he, uh, how do he do a lot of things? It, that's the problem, isn't it? It really I is. Guess, I guess you just hope the plus strength is good enough to not need guard. Yeah. yeah. Sometimes. It yeah, and you can still sometimes use the AVA to pull cages apart and pull people out of position and create weaknesses that way. It's just harder, isn't it? This kind of team. Yeah, that's much harder. Thing. And he could have taken guard as well, just quietly, on that throw. <laughs> so he's dead, Jim. He does not have Apple rights, that lineman. <laughs> Apple was already gone anyway, wasn't it? Yeah, but went earlier, didn't it, on the, uh, the AG5 that went down to the foul. Yeah, the AG5 blitzer there. And obviously that's more bench to foul with, so... Yeah. We're going to keep the fouling coming. Oh, I don't think anything is stopping the fouling on this team. <laughs> it's a key strategy. <laughs> Give me for a second, that's the front door. Yeah, this is what this I mean, this is what I was terrified of against Ducky, right? This was this was Ducky's main way into the game against me with his his kind of crappy team. It was just you know, you can just foul loads of people out and it's uh, it's not difficult, is it? I mean, he's still got the ball IK, which is guard, and more guard, and oh look, more guard. <laughs> yeah. And even if you try and hit one on the side, the ball carrier's got guard, so... <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it's looking very grim for the high elves, and especially as he's teeing off with the core pong as well, isn't it? That's the thing. Like, at least Ducky only had one mighty blow tackler against me, but, this, you know, this is tackle pom and frenzy. And jump up, so you can't even run away from him. Yeah, exactly. He's movement eight with jump up. It's it's fucking crazy, isn't it? It's a very. See, this is where I think jump up just 
leads really well with the movement eight. Yes, yeah, it's incredible. Completely incredible. Whereas if you get it on like a dwarf, it's like it's already moving four, it's not really moving <laughs> four. Are we palming? Of course we're palming. <laughs> oh, on everything. Oh, on the stun. But yeah, um, foul him, even though he stunned, I think, more than the strength. Oh, yeah, he's got him. He's got him. That's ridiculous. Of course he does. Uh, I mean, this DP block is kind of bloaty, but I guess. Why not? Just keep foul. That's his plan. Stick to it. <laughs> At this point, there's so little threat back, isn't there? <laughs> There we go, huge removal. Nice. It's looking real bad for Lesnik now. Just, just going for the uphill. Uh, wrestle, I mean, fair enough. Double power is good enough. Yeah. He's getting it! <laughs> it's the double power. It was like a one in nine, wasn't it? Because the board down was good with wrestle. Yeah. It wasn't a bad shot. Yeah, it wasn't a one in uh, 36. Well, it was doable. We get our score for in. Oh. He can reach it as well, but it is through diamond tackle. But he can he can reach it. <laughs> Long uh, we always gone though, so it's unlikely. Yeah, no, of course it was unlikely, but he it could have happened. He had to go if for it as well, didn't he? If that plus edge didn't get removed, maybe he could have gone it. So, yeah. yeah, it's good that we got rid of him. Yeah. And now we're just making everything safe as we do this free plus. Cheer five. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> for once we have to think about safe. But we're definitely bombing this guy. Oh yeah. This is where the jump up becomes amazing. You just get to the other side of the field. You don't care about frenzy. It's... Yeah, it's, it's and a we've good... got reroll cover, so this is a one in nine pickup. Mm -hmm. the, the stun is pretty big though on the uh, short hands. Yeah. Yeah, as long as we've still got the reroll, it's the same odds, but yes. Yeah. But we could have greed rerolled that block, PC. We could have pumped. No, no, he wouldn't have been in range anyway. <laughs> 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Like, it would have been GA5-ish. Yeah, it's pretty sure. Is it PC's mic that's making the scratching sound? I don't know. That, yes. that noise? That is PC. Yeah, that noise is PC. Um, that was me eating a cookie. Nah. <laughs> I do apologise. <laughs> It's PC the Dirty Dino! <laughs> it's not a snacker eating a cookie, don't worry. <laughs> Scratching. So much more wholesome, it was a, a cookie made by my lovely daughter. Well, this has gone exactly how I feared my match versus Ducky would have gone. Um, <laughs> <laughs> he's lost, lost his apple, yes, lots of loads there of players. Not elves. Yeah. This was the uh... Now, there can't be a one turn, can there? Because there's three stand firm on the line. Yep. And the movement's out, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, the plus movement's been cast. But, uh. So only the only worry movement. here is the riot, isn't it? Yes. Uh, could he still get it with a quick snap? No. No. No, because. Ah, uh, oh, could he? Because he's put the uh, zombies quite close. Yeah. Okay. So he's yeah he's given him he's given him like a tiny chance if it's a quick snap. But then he's still only movement eight and doesn't have side seven doesn't have many players so probably can't get it even on a quick snap. Maybe if I had side step on this guy, you know, so then with a quick yeah. snap and then blitz him. If he had a frenzy, step. so he could bring someone back to his side of the line and get the push started that way. But I think, really, no, no. I don't think that's... No, with his few players, uh, yeah, he needed sidestep and a quick snap. I'm, I'm pretty certain. <laughs> Just hope to remove one of these, I guess. Oh, but well, he did. He's got a KO. And a fresh and stone stone. Yeah, okay, that's a start, isn't it? Mm. If those two stay out, out, or even if any one does, that's something. That's a beginning. And we yeah. still have our KOs to come back, if they all come back. There's a completion for the uh, Bloodguard catcher. Oh, no, wait. 
<laughs> <laughs> he could get guard next, don't you worry? <laughs> Two out of three back. Ah, oh, the flesh golem came back. Yeah. Well, that's okay. We have some elves. Maybe he forgets him, leaves him off the pitch. So could <laughs> I You know, that, that's a decent player to be right. He is edge too, but um, it's still rather a zombie was on the field than that guy, wouldn't you? So three, six, nine players. He can, he can dacker this, can't he? And uh, take it overtime, maybe? There's still a yeah. chance. Deck is doesn't seem that good versus movement eight though, does it? It doesn't, but what else are you gonna do? Just get slaughtered <laughs> by a claw bomber if we turn <laughs> Like at least, I think you've got to at least make him like chase you with the like, you know, how does he get an assist with him on turn one? So you you're stopping him hitting you on turn one. And then turn two you can kind of try and move around him, I think. Yes, JP. Oh. Well, the touchback is going to help. Yeah. Don't have to waste if we all want to pick up, and we can keep them for the uh, overtime. Yeah. I think I'd rather had it on the uh, Arch Fiver, but never mind. He's, he's got to use his strong arm and pass and. <laughs> I guess that's another big problem with taking these skills is you rely, start relying on them a bit too much. Well, we saw this against um, Dionysian to the point where I think this is how he prefers to play. He will take the ball with the cat with the throw and drop way back, and then he looks to hold a high line and then push people up into the backfield. Yeah. Okay, he hasn't pushed anyone up though; just um, just held the high line. Which I would have much preferred to have kept a low line. Because <laughs> now the strength four is getting pumped, isn't he? Yeah, all day. And there's no frenzy traps or anything? No, particularly there's no frenzy trap. There's no one to push it on to. I guess there's just not enough people to stop it. Creating some threat elsewhere, isn't he? Yeah. And the second wolf is just like, instantly bases something and threatens you. Yep. I mean, I know there's some very fast pieces on Necromantic, but not all of them. I feel like if you're ready down numbers, you need to... Oh, but there we are, straight away. Does he even need to bow on, and he can use his extra movement? Yeah. <laughs> Base another guy. Yellow. Threat all over. This is. This is grim. Is this slight overcommitment? I mean, he's kept that one sweeper back. Yeah, maybe. Okay. Maybe an overcommit, but how do you exploit it? <sighs> yeah, I don't, I don't think there's a way through, though, is there? No, it's got like, to be movement aids on the other side, so even if you did get through, and like you'd have yeah. to get through on screen because otherwise the dogs are coming for you. And yeah. even if you just score, it's very early. You probably just very, stop very the early. score. Yeah, Failing another dodge. First action of the turns. Yeah. Well, there you go, see, see J5. If he, if he, if he didn't pursue the Daka when he was winning, then it would have saved him attrition, wouldn't it? So. You would like that's the thing. You would have to you would have to pursue your Daka to to get some attrition with his claw with his claw palm instead of just getting this this guy served up in a platter or this guy whichever one he wants to go for or even this guy. You know he can he can just slaughter people now. Well, I have a feeling it'll be the plus agility piece. Yes, I, I would go. For him. I can. Because he doesn't sidestep, that makes it much easier to get the uh, two die into two die. I don't hate going for the catcher because he's the movement eight guy. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, he was fine, but I think, I think you go for it. Here we go. Straight in on the plus agility. Gets the pal. Piles on. Of course. You go for one, and then the other one gets based by the other one. And it's fine, okay. Yeah, and the golem comes in to protect him from a foul back. Because you want to win the overtime, uh, J5, um, if you lose the toss. So if he doesn't get attrition in. He's still got nine L's at the moment. Well, had nine L's, he could have had ten L's in overtime. If you if you go up against ten L's and win the toss, you lose. <laughs> <laughs> Basically. 
So, yeah. Oh, God. 1D pow. Oh, good call by Muppet with the, um, go, you know, maybe he's go for the movement 8. Because now he's got a little outlet, hasn't he, here? Well, yeah, one less. That's certainly may create the space. And ball just running, running, serve. running away. God, that's, this is really risky against this, but he's not hes not doing it. Oh, fuck off. No, he's just pounding the He should have just goal. passed it to him, shouldn't he? Especially with the removal, he could have just got clear of everybody. I think that was yep. a big mistake to not go there through. There was a space though. to go. Yep, I think he had to go for it that turn. Yeah, you dodge through and then you curve back to the left, don't you? Yeah. Yeah, I think that's what he had to do. I mean, that uh, dive and tackle has saved that wolf from coming to get the ball. But... Yeah, yeah. Now he's got now he's got a nice screen for the wolves. So now, but no, oh, any of that could have failed, so it was very scary. Yeah. Yeah, I think I think he had to go because he's got to score himself, right? And I think that opportunity to get away from. Him. Ooh, top skulls there. Does he care about re rolls in overtime? He just wants to kill. <laughs> I mean, he's still, he had four already, so it's fair enough, right? If you if you're yeah. in normal time, then, then particularly on a dub skull, where you know it would be again first action of a turn, wasn't it? Yeah, there'd been a couple of moves, but nothing much else. I guess this is a usual high elf throw build, yeah, G6. I guess if you're, I guess if you're the type of person who wants a high elf throw, you want to take strong arm on a double. <laughs> yep. Yep. And accurate. Mm -hmm. I mean that that makes you better. You, you might as well do it well. now because you're not going to be able to do it in football free, but what? And they do have the, I mean, the gloriously overpowered safe throw. Yeah. You know, obviously the best skill in Blood Bowl. <laughs> I mean, it's been so dominant for all these years that it's had to be split into three parts in the upcoming rule book. And thank goodness that its tyranny is over. <laughs> Look at that, that was horrible, wasn't it? Look, he stacked the dodges and he had two more squares. He could have just gone the other yeah. way. Oof, big mistake there. Stacking them. Maybe he was running out of time. Yeah, sadly on a replay, we can't see time. No, we don't. Yeah. But this, oh, wow. Look, this is... This it's is fine green, now. It? It's fine, Jimmy. Elf just tastic. Dodge, dodge <laughs> some elves, do some GFIs, roll some sixes. That's oh. elves for you. I mean, there were some threes in there. As well as the twos. Yeah, that was a good time. You know, that, that makes elves frightened threes. <laughs> Yeah, J5, but he could have also, he could have also, uh, you know. <laughs> I mean, that could have been other things. Other things could have happened. But he's not piling mean? on. <gasps> the restraint is strong in this one. Outrageous. He just based Okay, he strength. has based it with a strength for blood step. And guard, don't forget guard. I'm forgetting the guard. I don't see its relevance right now. <laughs> I'm willing to be proved wrong. It can guard this is foul. Well, now you have to. Now you just have to pass it to this this Britter, don't you? That's your uh, that's your plan. You can make it. Uh... Well, you know how um, you know how some films they do something completely different with the sequel, and some they really don't. Yeah. I've noticed that at the back here is his thrower. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Um, he quite likes giving it to him and then hefting it up to someone far away on the opposite side. Yep. Oh, look. He's giving it to the thrower. Oh, no. No, look, he's not. He's running away. He is not hefting it to someone far up that side. That would be no, he does have someone far up that side. Yeah. I really do like just taking, like, you know, taking the score there, essentially, because... The wolf's the wolf can get you, can't he? <laughs> like it's it's uh, it's scary. It's scary leaving this score. To be fair, there's only one wolf now. We've got rid of one, so it's less scary. We just it's double mark scary. each of these, and we blitz the yeah the open one. Why are we we're blitzing in the wrong direction, Jim? Yeah, I'm not sure about that. We're scaring him. We were like, you better score next turn, or was. Look, I'm, I'm going to hurt one. your least important piece on the field right now. <laughs> yeah, I'd have definitely wanted my uh, my wolf back. I would blitz this one. Yeah. Awesome. We have zombies for this. It'll be fine. And we did the blitz before we moved these zombies into place. Yeah, they needed fear fans. They did. Okay. 
Well, That's the problem. Did both need one If we weren't point. hitting the ball or either of the receivers, shouldn't we maybe have done those a bit earlier? Yeah. Attrition, we need a foul. We've only got one piece person on the other receiver. Yeah. That doesn't seem like enough. And he can be blitzed off pretty new. Yeah, and he could have just moved this ghoul over, couldn't he? But instead he could. The, went for the foul first. So he's still in with a he's still in with another turn or two of Where's this catch go? It's gone back to have a little tuggle with the ball carrier and to wish it. There we are. It is just in case this failed, I think, to cover the ball. I'd rather it covered the thread. He's going to throw it. What the this square? I'd put it next to this square. Yeah, I'd rather it come upfield than uh, go back. Takes it. There we are. Now he can either score or the stall's probably on. Oh no! He Wait. does a bit of both. Wait! Why? He did an L shape. Yeah, it's a bit of showboating there. Toxic showboating. He, he went to score and then changed his mind. He was like, I, I can maybe stall here. <laughs> yeah, it was like, wait, yes, wait, I, wait a yeah, minute. Some people in the chat know I have seen all this before. I'm pretending I haven't. <laughs> yeah. I think doing an extremely good job. Because, of course, I knew that was going to come. That ridiculous. I mean, me too, because I also Look, watched... Look, he's now blitzable with a wrestle ghoul on just needing a simple little... Oh, it is diving tackle, so it would be a... Yeah, five plus so that's actually pretty good, that, isn't it? Yeah, but he can't sandwich the blitzer for afterwards. Nope, we killed the threat player. The thrower is yeah. the most threat. We need to kill him for overtime. <laughs> I won. Let's go. Well, Why not? No, we knocked him out. That'll probably do. We're not crazy, crazy. <laughs> oh, I think we're getting another foul. Yeah, we're getting another foul. Boy, howdy! Nice yeah, making the block. Man. He's wrestling. Down. Oh, oh we're fouling this instead. piece. Okay. Oh, wow. <laughs> of course he we does are. He does have DP, and if one doesn't, so. Yeah. Yeah, and if you if you break his AV, then he can't stall, can he? So yeah, it's not that's not bad. I don't I don't hate that. So he's gonna have to bang it in. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I mean, rather than the four, the five plus to threaten the ball, I think that's probably a very solid turn's worth of action. The other one's under threat, and he's. See that catcher could have been upfield this time to help. Yeah. But instead, he came back. Yeah, I didn't like him coming back. No, I thought um, for what you had planned, it was. I was trying to mitigate the risk of that um, one in nine, one in thirty-six dodge out for the piece that blitzed off the cover on the receiver. Yeah. But I don't think that was enough anyway. That if that had failed, I still think you were in such huge trouble. But, but the other wolf has come back, so it's pretty good. Looking to turn, honestly. Two movement, eight pieces. Yeah. Well, there's only seven elves. That's the problem here. Yeah. There's no one willing to stop you. Yeah, first the left elves. You weren't really fancy Good this. Good responsive but... ones are dead, but um, it's certainly, you know, there's all sorts of things that can go wrong. The pick up, the handoff. I mean, it is still, even for these rowdy wolves, quite a long way. Would you commit rerolls here? Or would you keep both? Is the score likely enough for you to make, commit rerolls? Yes. Yeah, definitely. I mean, I've got three of them anyway. And yeah. winning in two means I don't face 50% chance of even seven elves with the ball and two rerolls they've currently got. Couldn't score anyway. Yeah. Elf's gonna elf, as the great man yep. once said. Yeah. <laughs> I think I invented that, Jim. <laughs> oh, a frank confession. PC is stood now. <laughs> Heard it here first, guys. <laughs> he has to be an alt of somebody, doesn't he? Like, there's no way yeah. he wasn't someone's alt. Had to be. I mean, he could have been his own alt, but it was obviously a lived character. Yeah. All the more glorious for it. <laughs> not pomming. What the We're fuck? We're not pomming. We have restraint. What the fuck? Well, that's because I mean, we're trying to sort of look. We're going to go forwards and do some winning. I mean, it was still a tackle, my blow hit. You didn't have to pile on. Yeah. Well, he's got the handoff here. Uh, yeah, yeah, he's going to go straight for it, isn't he? Yeah, yeah no messing around here. All Double gear. Gosh. Boom. Who needs rerolls anyway? Oh, I think with the ball in the wolf's hands, I now fear for the elves. I think this is bleak. A very bleak, yeah. 
That's why the golem hasn't come yet, it's because it's going to do some rowdy go for it, because he's got the rerolls. Yep. I think it does two here. No, just the one. Yeah, because he's, he's the backside's open, isn't it? I think. Yeah, yeah, okay, yeah, it is. Yeah, okay, so that's solid. He's got the eye cage, and now it's on the other is coming. IGL. Oh, no, it's not. That's game ending, isn't it? Yeah, it's in yeah. the he is exactly eight squares away from this touchdown. <laughs> and this game we learned Wolves are fast. Boom! Well, there we are. Yeah. Lesnick, conqueror of Dionysian, is better, a greater coach than Dionysian. <laughs> Knocked out there. By the second Dio. By Diomed, the, uh, the necromantic coach. Yeah. Dio in a Dio, unbelievable. Hot Dio action this tournament for Lesnick. <laughs> I would have loved to see him find, face a third Dio. Yeah, yeah, he, he beats Dio. Lesnick lived Dio to more. Dio another day. Oh, 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 very good. Very good. Uh, uh, brilliant. Well, congratulations, Dio Med. Commiserations, Lesnick. Thank you very much, Muppet Pac Man and Purple Chest. Thank you. You're welcome. And uh, thanks for watching everyone, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic. <laughs>